Hey everyone, in this video I want to talk to you about how people will judge you anyway, so be who you desire. This is all about maximizing your time being alive. If you live for other people, if you let them determine your life path because you want to please them or you want to obtain their validation and attention or their approval, then you're pretty much wasting your time on this planet. You never know how much time you're going to get. so. Why would you spend most of it trying to please other people? Or, in some cases, why would you bottle up your authentic self because you're afraid of being judged by others? Those people who are going to judge you, they're going to do so no matter who you are. You could be the best person out there and they would judge you anyway. So, why do you care what they think of you? The people who engage in that behavior to that degree are usually not good people anyway, so their opinions, I like to argue, have little to no value. Most people will kind of engage in snap judgments when they first see you. I mean, we all do that. We know that that's part of what we do. We as human beings just observe things, and with that, there will naturally be a small degree of judgment. For instance, if you're walking down the street and you notice someone approaching you, you're going to immediately notice certain things about them. For instance, the first thing you'll probably be thinking of is whether or not this person seems like a threat to you, because that's survival instinct. You want to make sure that they're not going to stab you when you're walking by them, right? That's a snap judgment that you're going to make, even if it's a bit subconscious, that you're, you're not even fully aware of it. So most people will engage in that behavior. So that's not what I'm talking about. That's a very natural thing. I don't even know if we can turn that off. That's almost an instinctual thing that we do. What I'm talking about are people who continue to judge you beyond that point. Most people will try to withhold judgment to some extent because they know that they can't get the full picture of someone just by looking at them or even from hearing them speak about themselves for five minutes. It usually takes way longer than that to get to know someone. So if someone's going to judge you based off initial impressions and they have no willingness to change their mind, who cares what they think of you? You shouldn't give two shits about their opinion of you at all. What's far more important is just being you, being authentic, being real, because that's what allows you to truly enjoy being alive. I mean, how could you enjoy yourself if you're always bottling up who you are, the real you? This is why so often in my prior videos and in my Instagram posts, I always talk about being authentic because I truly don't believe you can maximize your time being alive if you aren't authentic. You need to be true to you and what you desire in life. Live for yourself. Stop worrying about people judging you. Stop caring about their opinions of you. That's all just noise. Most of these people who judge you, you're never going to see again. Or in the cases where it's coworkers or family members or things like that, just limit your time around them. You don't need to be around people who have that kind of judgmental energy. Nobody likes that. So just ignore their opinions and keep doing you. Keep being real. This is so important. I mean, for real, you never know how much time you're going to get. You could get 20 more years from now. You could get five more years. You could get 40 more years. Who knows? But you need to make sure that you spend that time living for you, doing what you truly desire. So first off, get to know yourself. Ask yourself, who am I? And be honest about the answer because that will help you get in more in touch with the real authentic you. But then number two, make sure you actually ask yourself what you want so that you have a roadmap of what to work towards in life so that you can have your life journey planned. Because if you don't know what you want, then you're probably going to be living for other people. If your parents tell you that, oh, you'd make a good engineer, you're probably going to go to engineering school. So make sure you know what you desire so that you live for you and ask yourself, do I really want to be an engineer? Sure, they make a lot of money, but what if I end up unhappy? Is that worth my time? You got to ask yourself those questions. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you'd like to support me, the easiest thing you can do is just give this video a like to help the algorithm so that hopefully my content can reach more people and help them as well. But anyway, I, I hope you enjoyed this video. I already said that. That's being redundant. <laughs> Whatever. I'll see you guys in the next video. Arrivederci.